In mathematics, we encounter situations where we need to arrange or select items from a set. The concepts of permutations and combinations help us tackle such problems. A permutation is an ordered arrangement of a set of distinct objects. The order in which objects are chosen matters, hence we define permutation as the number of permutations of n indistinct objects taken r at a time is given by npr equal to n factorial over n minus r factorial. A combination is a selection of a set of objects, regardless of the order. The order in which objects are chosen does not matter. Therefore, the number of combinations of n distinct objects taken r at a time is given by ncr equal to n factorial over n minus r factorial times r factorial. Let us use these concepts to solve some model problems. Sarah, Anfal, and Fatima applied for a job of a manager and a department head. In how many ways could the two positions be filled? Here, there are three candidates for the job of a manager and department head. Hence, we select any of the two candidates for the job of a manager and department head. In this case, order is important as there are two specific positions. Therefore, we use permutation formula, which is given below. Here, there are three candidates. Therefore, n equal to 3. We have to choose 2 of the 3 candidates. Therefore, r equal to 2. Substituting above values in the formula, we get 3p2 equals 3 factorial over 3 minus 2 factorial. On simplification, we get 6 ways. Let us do one mere problem. Sarah, Anfal, and Fatima are qualified to enter an art competition. Only 2 candidates are to be picked up. In how many ways could the 2 candidates be selected? Here, there are three qualified candidates to enter the competition, and we select two candidates out of three. In this case, order is not important as we pick any two out of three candidates. Therefore, we use the combination formula which is given below. Here, there are three candidates, therefore n equal to three. We have to pick two of them. Therefore, r equal to two. Substituting above values in the formula, we get three c2 equal to three factorial over three minus two factorial times two factorial on simplification we get three ways thank you for watching